Hello. Today we are going to look at telling time using the words quarter to. Remember that the shorthand shows the hours and the longhand shows the minutes. Let's look at how the clock can be divided in quarters. This is half the clock. This is in quarters. There are four quarters to this clock. It takes 15 minutes for the minute's hand to travel through each quarter of the clock. In this lesson, we are going to focus on the last quarter, the last 15 minutes of the hour. Let's look at this clock. If we look at our minute hand, we can see that it has traveled 45 minutes, or three quarters of the way around the clock. It has 15 minutes or one quarter left to go until it becomes the next hour. The hour hand is almost at the next hour. You can see how it's a little closer to one number than the other. When I read the time, I read it as 12.45. It's 45 minutes after 12. I can also say this as quarter to one because it's almost at the next hour. In 15 minutes it will be one o'clock. Let's take a look at the time here. The minute hand is on the 9. That means there are 15 minutes until the next hour. The hour hand is almost at 11. Which means it's still 10 o'clock, not 11 yet. So what time is it? It's 10.45. We can also say a quarter to 11. Pay attention. On the next clock, the minute hand will be on the 9 and the hour hand will almost be on the next hour. When we describe the time, we are going to use the words quarter to the next hour. Now let's practice. Try and say it both ways before I do. What time is it? It's 1.45 or quarter to 2. What time is it? It's 11.45 or quarter to 12. What time is it? It's 2.45 or quarter to 3. This is our last one. What time is it? It's 8.45 or quarter to 9. Good job, everyone. And keep practicing.